Hello, my name is Walter and welcome back to Steven Universe Season 4, Episode 19, Room for Ruby. <coughs> Sorry. Um, so, this episode I'm thinking is going to be about Ruby. Um, well, I mean, that's the title of the episode, sure. Um, and just remember, I will be doing um, Samurai Jack after this, hopefully. Um, don't know how fast the upload will be because of uploads as well in the sites that I'm watching so stay just stay tuned for that anyway without further ado let's go are the crystal gems will always save the day and if you think we can't we'll always find a way that's why the people on this world believe in Grand and Amethyst and Pearl and Steven Room for Ruby Yep, uh, so in the last one I remember uh, something about uh, Steven uh, um, Steven wanting to go out on top on his wrestling career So that was pretty cool though that uh, the tiger millionaire turned into a tiger philanthropist uh... no that's a falling that's a falling sp spaceship for sure but it's a ruby am i right? i'm right Yeah. <laughs> this is a surprise. It is. Hmm. Okay. That's cool. Yeah, that was fun. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, I, I'm with the garden on this one. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's true. <laughs> yeah, that's true. All right, Stephen Universe. I've never heard her say his full name before. <laughs> and pumpkin can't forget you. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> awkward, real awkward. <laughs> I I would lapis in this one. <laughs> He's just she's just floating around now. <laughs> Oh my god, I love that visual. <laughs> I mean, it, it is suspicious though. Yeah, but I guess like it, they, you kind of built uh, character development with them, uh, Steven. Um, I'm just saying, you should build character development with uh, Ruby as well. So... I mean that's also true. Like I guess new new friends are good, but I think yeah you you can take it slow and you always can have a side of caution. You know. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> She's so excited to learn though. <laughs> 
I mean, that's true. Life doesn't really make sense as well. I mean, yeah, we had two world wars, uh, a cold war. Uh, I mean, that's true. Well, it's... Yeah, I mean... What is Rin? Yeah, I mean, she has water powers, right? <laughs> there we go. That's Rain, yep. Aw, she's so cute. <laughs> they both play in the rain now. She's so excitable. It's, it's so cool. Hmm. <laughs> Doubt. <laughs> it's a hammock, yeah. I mean, well, you know. <laughs> she snores. Oh, that's okay though. I mean, you yeah, you close your eyes, right, and you fall into a subconscious. Oh, <laughs> that's cool. <laughs> nice. I think she's fit to be an Earthling. And well, the reason why humans need sleep, and I really love this stuff as well, uh, is because your body needs recharging. So, I don't know about gems, maybe they don't really have energy or whatever. Maybe their energy comes from their gemstone, which is ever, uh, ever giving her energy. Oh yeah, pumpkin is cute though. <laughs> pumpkin likes... Pumpkin likes uh, navel too. <laughs> Shrugs and rolls in the dirt. Okay, I think Lapis is a little um, jealous, maybe? I don't know why. Oh, oh. Nah. Don't feel too bad. There's a saying that, you know, there's a saying that goes, you trust people, but you don't trust too much. That's all I'm saying. That's my saying. <laughs> Still saying, God damn it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know. People, some people t are really excited to learn new stuff, like me. Not necessarily in the academic sense, but in the worldly sense, you know? Aw, oh, she has the little dimples and everything. She's so cute. Whoa.
<laughs> I would love that. Uh, okay, I, I mean, you know. <coughs> I'm all for character resolution and everything, but, you know. What? What happened? I mean, this is what I was guessing. Dramatic irony, am I right? <laughs> uh. <laughs> well, she has the rings. I mean, why didn't she use the rings? Yeah, I, 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 I have to say. <laughs> <laughs> it was still worth a shot. <laughs> Alright, well, you know, I was about to say, like, I, I expected a little bit of dramatic irony, uh, because, you know, not everything is wrapped up in a nice little bowl, and, you know, tied in it. Uh, so, yeah, it was a really good episode, especially when, you know, the... The voice actress in this one really does the um, well. I don't want to say raspy, but just that really squeaky, high-pitched, um, cutesy voice really well, and that's that's what really gets me. So <laughs> I I just I just like the visuals in this one, the visual jokes especially. Um, so yeah, that was about it, guys, and I will see you at Samurai Jack. See you then.